Hello guys, it's the Gamer Beanie here today with the Nissan 370Z drift build. This car's peak power is second to third gear. Um, it likes to stay in second gear a lot more than third to be honest, but you can get a really good high speed drift out of it in second as well. I think it goes up to something like 80 miles per hour in second gear. Uh, so you're always at that rev limiter which sounds really nice. Uh, for this drift build, uh, you're going to install everything engine wise anyway, so let's just say that. Um, I would like to thank you again, I know I keep saying this, but right. for so the support in uh, my videos so far, um, I really appreciate it. Because I've only got 5 subscribers, which I appreciate. Don't don't think I don't appreciate any 5 of you that's subscribed. I really do if you're watching this. Uh, thank you very much. Um, but yeah, it's pretty crazy. I started on a new YouTube, obviously. I've got like nearly 80 views on my first video, which I really appreciate. So thanks for that, guys. So for engine, you're going to install everything maximum on this car. Then for your platform and handling, again, you're going to install everything maximum. I got some good news as well. Um, hopefully soon I should be getting my HD PVR which means better quality videos and obviously longer videos and stuff like commentary gameplays and uh, some funny montages and stuff like that. I'm actually working on a drift montage for Forza at the moment as well so keep an eye out for that. So for your um, platform, uh, your different, your sorry, your drivetrain and everything like that, again there's no more everything maxed. Your tire compound, stock, your whips, stock, your rims, choose whatever you want but I'll show you the rims I got because I think they look really nice on this car. I put 28, 20 inch rims on this on front and rear and I'll show you the bumpers I put on. I left the front bumper standard, the spoiler standard and the rear bumper, we've got the Nismo and for the side skirts we've got the Nismo too. <coughs> so for tune you're going to put your alignment on negative minus 1.0 for front and rear, your toe out on the front is going to be 0, 0.0, your toe out on the rear is 1.5 and your front caster is going to be high 7.0, springs just drop it as normal and then for your differential you're going to do 100% acceleration and 0% on deceleration. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, thumbs up, drop a like, comment, subscribe uh, I am out. Peace.